Sport is a massive part of my life. Um, kind of probably 12 hours a day is basically based around sport. It Obviously it's good to keep you active and healthy physically and psychologically, um, but it also gives me something to strive for, something to try and get better all the time. So you never kind of sit at a, at a level where you're kind of almost satisfied. So it really gives you something to get up for in the morning and think, okay, how can I be better today? And obviously striving towards Paralympics, that really keeps you pushing forward and uh, it's been a massive part of my life. What I love about equestrian and competing is the connection you have between your horses. Um, as you go through the levels of the competition, you get to the highest levels. You've been through a lot with those horses um, through probably quite a long amount of time. So by the time you get to a big competition, obviously it's, um, it's a bit of a journey really, and it's that, that climax of the journey. National Paralympic Day is a really special event because it really brings about the legacy of London 2012 with the Paralympics and bringing about sport for uh, people with disabilities and, and opening up that opportunity for people to try different sports um, and really enjoy them. I'd encourage people to come down to National Paralympic Day at the Queen Elizabeth Olympic Park in London on the 26th of July. It's going to be a fantastic event um, with world-class sport um, and the opportunity to buy tickets to go and watch um, events like swimming and athletics um, and people like David Weir are going to be competing. So it's an amazing opportunity to have a look at those sports and actually be involved with it as well.